Welcome Legendary Proxy Faithen to Zenless Zone Zero and D&D. I'm the Zeo Striker Bang Boo guiding you through this build. Today's commission will be about the Sons of Kaladin's bartender, Bernice. We'll start by picking Bernice's species, which will be human. She learns the languages of Orc and Dwarvish. She also gets resourceful, giving her heroic inspiration after a long rest. Bernice also gets an origin feat and that'll be skilled. With this, she gets proficiency in Brewers, Herbalism Kit, and Alchemist tools. Next is Bernice's background, which is Acolyte. She gets proficiency in Insight, Religion, and Calligrapher's tools. Then she gets the origin feat Magic Initiate, Cleric, and the spells will be going off of Intelligence. She picks up the cantrips Sacred Flame and Word of Radiance, and the first level spell Guiding Bolt. She finishes with a plus two in Int and a plus one to Charisma. Now finishing up with Bernice's stats, she'll go standard array and will get an 8 in strength, a 14 in dexterity, a 12 for constitution, 15 in intelligence, 10 for wisdom, and a 13 in charisma. Thanks to Acolyte, Bernice wraps up with a 17 in intelligence and a 14 in charisma. Bernice will start off as an artificer. Level 1 artificer gives her proficiency in medicine, arcana, thieves, tinkerers, and cooks tools. Bernice also gets Magical Tinkering, which lets her imbue mundane objects with one of four properties. She also gets access to spells. Here she'll pick up the cantrips Firebolt and Light, and then she picks up the first level spells Cure Wounds, Fairy Fire, and Grease. Level 2 Artificer gives Bernice Artificer Infusions. She can select a certain number of these infusions to imbue objects with magic effects. The ones she'll pick up are Enhanced Arcane Focus, giving her a plus one to spells for both rolls, Enhanced Defense gives her a plus one to her AC. Mind Sharpener makes it so that she can succeed on a concentration save that she failed and replicate the magic item Alchemy Jug. She also picks up the spell Absorb Elements. At level three Artificer, Bernice gets her subclass as an Artillerist. This gives her the Elch Cannon, which can take one of three forms, one of which is a flamethrower, and she can use her bonus action to attack with it. She also gets the Woodcarver's Proficiency and the right tool for the job, which lets her make any set of art artisan's tools that last an hour. The subclass also gives her the spell Shield and Thunder Wave. At level 4 Artificer, Bernice gets an ability score improvement and picks up the feat Warcaster. This gives her a plus 1 to intelligence, making it an 18. She also gets advantage on con saves for concentration, can use a single target spell for opportunity attacks, and she can cast spells if both her hands are holding something. She also picks up the spells Purify Food and Water and Featherfall. Level 5 Artificer gives Bernice Arcane Firearm. This lets her carve sigils into a wand, staff, or rod, transforming them into an arcane firearm to conduct her destructive spells. She can also use this as a focus, and when she casts a spell, she can add a d8 to the damage. Her subclass also gives her the spells Scorching Ray and Shatter. Now that we have two flamethrowers, Bernice can jump over to Wizard. Level 1 Wizard gives Bernice Arcane Recovery and Ritual Adept. Arcane Recovery lets her regain back spell slots equal to half her level in Wizard on a short rest and can do this once a day. The Ritual Adept just lets her cast spells for the Ritual Tag if they have them. She also picks up the cantrips Control Flames, Elementalism, and Prestidigitation, and the first level spells Burning Hands, Cause Fear, Chromatic Orb, Color Spray, Magic Missile, and Silvery Barbs. At level 2 wizard, Bernice gets expertise in Persuasion and picks up the spells Caustic Brew and Ray of Sickness. At level 3 wizard, Bernice gets her subclass being Invoker. She gets Potent Cantrip and Evocation Savant. Potent Cantrip makes it so if Bernice misses with an attack or the target saves against a cantrip, they still take half the damage but no additional effects from the cantrips. Evocation Savant gives Bernice additional evocation spells when she gains access to new level spells in Wizard. Here she can pick up two and picks up Darkness and Agazer's Scorcher. Then she has access to second level spells and picks up Dragon's Breath and Flaming Spear. Level four Wizard gives Bernice an ability score improvement and picks the feat Elemental Adapt. This gives her a plus one to intelligence, making it a 19. She can also now ignore fire resistance that enemies have and all ones rolls count as two for damage. She also picks up the cantrip Dancing Lights and the second level spell Blur and Pyrotechnics. Level five Wizard gives Bernice Memorize Spells and access to third level spells. Memorize Spells lets Bernice change one of her prepared spells with another spell she knows during a short rest. Since she gets access to third level spells, she gets a free evocation spell and picks up Fireball. 
and then she chooses to pick up Counterspell and Ashardalan Stride. At level 6 wizard, Bernice gets Sculpt Spells. This lets her make pockets of safety for her AoE spells so allies automatically succeed saves from them and take no damage. She can grant this to several people based on the spell level plus one. She also picks up the spells Fear and Minute Meteors. With that done, we can go back to Artificer for the rest of the build. At level 6 Artificer, Bernice gets Tool Expertise, which lets her double her proficiency bonus for any tool she's proficient in. She also gets a new Infusions, being Spell Refueling Ring, which lets her regain a third level spell slot or lower, and replicates the magic item Lantern of Revealing. And she picks up the spell Heat Metal. Level 7 Artificer gives Bernice Flash of Genius, which lets her use a reaction to potentially help herself or an ally with an ability check or saving throw, and they add her intelligence mod to the roll. She can do this several times equal to her intelligence modifier. Level 8 Artificer gives Bernice another ability score improvement, and she picks up the feat Spell Sniper. This gives her a plus 1 to intelligence and the ability to ignore half and third cover for ranged attacks can cast range spells in melee with no disadvantage and increases the range of her range spells by 60 feet. She then picks up the spells Continual Flame and Sea Invisibility. At level 9 Artificer, Bernice gets Explosive Cannon. This makes her Eldritch Cannon deal an extra d8 for damage and as an action she can have the cannon self-destruct to have each creature within 20 feet make a save or take damage or half as much on a success. Her subclass also gives her Fireball and Windwall, which are always prepared. At level 10 Artificer, Bernice gets Magic Item Adept, which lets her tune to 4 magic items, and making common or uncommon magic items takes shorter time and costs half as much. Bernice also gets Infusions being replicating magic items Cloak of Protection and Winged Boots. And she picks up the Cantrip's Guidance and the 3rd level spell Catnap. Level 11 Artificer gets Bernice Spell Storing Item, which lets her store a first level or a second level spell in an item from her Artificer list that anyone can use several times equal to her Intelligence Modifier times 2. Level 12 Artificer gets Bernice her last ability score improvement, being a plus 2 to Constitution, making it a 14. At level 13 Artificer, Bernice gets access to 4th level spells, and her subclass gives her Ice Storm and Wall of Fire. And then she picks up another spell being Elemental Bane. At level 14 Artificer, Bernice's final level, she gets Magic Item Savant, which lets her tune to up to 5 magic items and ignores all restrictions for tuning to a magic item. She also gets 2 more infusions and replicates the magic items Amulet of Health and Bracers of Defense. She also picks up the Cantrip Mending and the 4th level spell Summon Construct. And that concludes the quirky bartender of the Sons of Caladons, Bernice. She's excellent at helping you forget your problems with her warm personality. But let's go over some of our build picks. The biggest things we wanted were fire related abilities and the flamethrowers for obvious reasons. This narrowed the choices quite a bit to Artificer, Wizard, and Cleric surprisingly. Artificer we played with the idea for Alchemist since it's a bartender but we couldn't pass up on the actual flamethrower from Artillerist. Evoca was always going to be picked just cause Fireball, but it was a hard deciding if we wanted to go more Artificer or Wizard, but figured we would get more from Artificer. Light Cleric was an idea that we played with just for the fact that bright lights to blind people and other things like that, but decided not to go with it. Most spells choices came down to if they could deal fire or radiant damage for obvious reasons, while others we made and chose since if it would make sense for drink slash concoction ideas since she's a bartender that makes wild drinks. And that was basically it. But thank you Traveler for watching this video. You can find more commissions to watch here and you can leave a comment if there's anything you'd like to change for this build. But don't forget to like and subscribe too. Until next time, I wish you all a great morning, evening, or afternoon. Ciao ciao!